My name is Shiny Ann John, and I'm the very proud principal of Thomas Viaduct Middle School. The staff at our school have been working hard to prepare and plan for the upcoming school year. We've already been in contact with your staff at your schools, and we've been setting up programs, clubs, and activities that help meet the needs of our new students that are coming in. I know I speak for my entire staff when I send you a heartfelt welcome to the Thomas Viaduct family. We can't wait to meet you and your families next year. During this orientation, you will be given a very short tour of our middle school. We will also share information with you regarding the various programs, clubs, and activities that we have to offer at Thomas Viaduct. Now some of you might be interested in our Student Government Association and becoming leaders in our school. Others of you might be involved and interested in hearing about our performing arts programs, our drama programs, our after school clubs and activities. Whatever your interests are, I know that we will have something that meets your needs at Thomas Viaduct. Hopefully the information that we share with you today will help you feel more confident and eager to enter our doors in the fall. Most importantly, during the orientation today, we hope that we are able to convey our love and our enthusiasm for our school, even through this virtual realm, to you and to your families. We're incredibly proud of Thomas Viaduct Middle School, and we are very excited to have you join us in the fall. Please do not hesitate to reach out to me with any questions or clarifications if you need any. On behalf of my entire staff, I want to welcome you to the Thomas Viaduct family. Hello future Timberwolves, I'm Miss Herrig and I'm one of the school counselors here at Thomas Viaduct Middle School. And I'm Ms. Reins, the other counselor at Thomas Viaduct. We are so excited to have you join the Thomas Viaduct family. As your counselors, we are here for you for so many things. To talk about your grades, assist with goal setting, or to discuss any peer conflicts, just to name a few. We want you to have a successful year in all areas at TVMS. We hope you might get involved in our leadership program as a student ambassador, or join enrichment activities while getting assistance with work, through our Beyond the Wolf Den after school program, or to strive to make the honor roll by working hard in your classes. Most of all, we want you to build great connections with staff and students. We would love to help in any way. Have a wonderful end to your school year and a great summer. We will see you all soon. Bye. Bye. Welcome, Timberwolves. My name is Jaiset Castillo. I am the Hispanic Achievement Liaison at Thomas Viaduct Middle School. I work with students, families, and staff, and I'm looking forward to see you next year. My contact information is at the end of the slide. Please contact me at any time. Bienvenidos. Middle School. My name is Anil and I am in 6th grade and I am part of the TV crew. We call our show TV Squared. If we were in person, we would be coming to you live from the den, the name of our studio, but instead we welcome you this way. Hi, my name is Christabel and I am an 8th grader and the TV Squared producer. I have been involved with a television production seminar all three years in middle school, but TV crew is only one of the many activities you can be involved in as part of the TVMS family. TV production is a GT seminar that all students can join. GT seminars are based on student interests. Some of the seminars at TVMS include African American History, Book Club, Debate, Film Institute, Photography, Environmental Studies, Mystery Club, and Writers Workshop. Hi, my name is Jack and I'm an 8th grader and crew leader at TV Squared. In addition to GT seminars, which meets during the day, we also have an after school program called Beyond the Wolf Den with additional clubs and opportunities. 
This includes homework club, sports, yoga, step team to school play, and more. Hi, I'm Joy, another sixth grader in TV Square. GT seminars and Beyond the Wolf Den are only a couple of the many ways to be involved at TVMS. We have many fun evening activities too, like school dances, World Fest, History Month, Celebration, Health and Wellness Night, The Talent Show, Howling with Pride Night, and more. TVMS also loves to celebrate students, so we have quarterly assemblies called TVMS One Voice and Pride Celebration Days. There is so much going on at TVMS, and we can't wait for you to join us. I know that coming to middle school for the first time or to a new middle school can seem really scary. Getting involved really helps. The teachers and staff at TVMS are here to support you. So listen closely to the information in this video. And don't worry, we are a family and we take care of each other. And now we've come to the end of our segment. At the end of every TV show, we end with a thought or a quote of the day. So we leave you with this thought from famous singer Rihanna. I'm really looking forward to seeing what life brings to me. We hope that you are looking forward to coming to Thomas Viaduct and what life will bring to you. Bye! Hi everyone, welcome to TVMS. My name is Nina Paparazzo and I'm the seventh grade team leader. My name is Mariana Veltri and I'm the eighth grade team leader. 
This video is meant to give you information about our school that you will need to know for the new year, so please follow along accordingly. If you have any questions, feel free to reach out. We're very excited very, to meet you. Very excited. Here's some information on day-to-day -day life at TVMS. First, a welcome from our administration. Mrs. Ketterman, our assistant principal, is on the left. Mrs. John, our principal, is in the middle. And Mrs. Harden, our assistant principal, is on the right. Welcome also from the 7th and 8th grade teams. We're very excited to meet you. Here's our daily schedule. 7th grade schedule is in the middle in yellow. In the mornings, you'll have homeroom and then first and second period. Third and fourth period are your related arts classes, and then you have lunch. Fifth, sixth, and seventh period will also be back in the seventh grade hall, and then it's dismissal. Eighth grade students start their morning with their related arts classes. They will then have periods three, four, and five, then lunch, then periods six and seven. Seventh grade students will receive their locker at the start of the school year. Different things can go in your lockers like backpacks, extra school supplies, or a jacket and a coat. You're able to go to your locker before school, before or after lunch, before related arts, and at the end of the day. Just as a reminder, students should not be sharing lockers, and they will also need to keep their locker combination in a safe place. Eighth grade students carry their backpacks to classes. They do not receive a locker unless specifically requested. Lunch and recess are 30 minutes each day. Your lunch monitor will let you know when your table or section is able to go outside for recess. Recess is every day unless it's raining or too cold or too hot. If you're going to be with a teacher for something like a lunch bunch or extra help, you must have a pass. Most classes will have homework for most nights of the week. It is important to also study and review your notes, organize assignments into your binder, and make sure all of your assignments are complete. Make sure you use some kind of calendar or organizational tool to help you keep track of your assignments. Also very important is to check Canvas frequently. Your teachers will be sending you messages, posting things on the calendar, and putting important information in their courses. We have a variety of celebrations at TVMS. For instance, we have our TVMS One Voice Assemblies, where we celebrate our differences in culture and experiences. We also have Wolf Pride Days, where we play games and have fun, pack leader of the month, and occasional drawings for great prizes. After school, we have Beyond the Wolf Den. This is a cost-free opportunity for students to participate in various enrichment programs. For instance, there's Art Club, computer club, sports, or academic support. More information will be sent home in the fall about how to sign up for this great opportunity. In addition to Beyond the Wolf Den, we have the RISE program. The Horizon Foundation partnered with the Howard County Department of Recreation and Parks and with HCPSS to expand this after-school opportunity to more students. For two hours twice a week, Students will have the opportunity to play a variety of sports under the leadership of a certified coach. Information about enrollment will be sent home during the 2020-2021 school year. There are a variety of ways that students and parents can get involved at TVMS. Students should consider joining our Student Government Association. There are a variety of roles for students to participate. From president to treasurer, there's also DEN representatives, you can make sure that your voice and your classmates is heard. Students and parents also have the opportunity to join our PTSA. This is perfect for forming a relationship between teachers, students, and staff, and our community. For more information, please visit us at tvms.hcpss.org on Twitter and or sign up for our newsletter, which comes out frequently. One important date to remember is back to school night on September 10th, 2020. Here's contact information for some key people at our school. Our principal, Ms. John, our assistant principal, Ms. Harden, our assistant principal, Ms. Ketterman, our school counselors, our school psychologist, 
and a variety of other people who may be able to offer you important information. Please feel free to contact us at any time. If you would like to access more contact information, please go to our school website and go to our staff. We're very excited to meet you here at TVMS, but please feel free to reach out if you have any questions or concerns.